From musical theater to art shows, concerts, tango lessons, there is pretty much something for everyone at the 19th Festival Celebration in Charleston. News Channel 3's Kimberly Donahue is on scene with a look at what festival has to offer this year. The 19th ever festival celebration kicks off tonight with plenty of new and unique music and arts events that organizers say will be sure to put the capital city on the map as a cultural destination. As the countdown to festival ticks down, those running the show say to be ready for a lot of motion. Be prepared for a lot of movement, a lot of vibrance, a lot of folks in and around the city of Charleston. You know, we've got things in every kind of pocket. Experiences like Argentine tango lessons for the first time on the festival schedule, held at Vino's Bar and Grill tonight. You don't need to bring a partner with you. It's going to go over all the basics and things. And so uh, we've actually got an instructor from Argentina that's going to be here that's doing uh, traditional Argentine tango lessons and actually a performance as well. Amid the new additions to the festival calendar, organizers say they're pleased to help boost the name of local businesses. We've heard from businesses on Capitol Street that they see receipts that are pretty much in line with what they would see on New Year's Eve or some sort of a holiday. And so we're really excited to be able to bring that uh, money into the community. There are certain things that festival really wants to help provide for the community. One is a really culturally rich experience and being able to attract tourists, uh, tourism and attract folks that may want to come move here. You know, we want to make sure that people know that there's talent and a lot of the arts right here in Charleston, West Virginia. Festival runs every day through June 18th. You can get a preview of each day's events on our newscast. Kimberly Donahue, WSAZ News Channel 3, Kanawha County.